Nice, man. I love it. Okay, we are in the Platinum Age, baby. Welcome back, everybody, to Icarus. I'm an old guy gaming, and we finally found some more Platinum. So I am... Uh, here's my little lake right here. Uh, we are way down uh, to the southwest here along this cliff face. And I found this cave here. Um, and we found some platinum here. So let's... Um, there's also... There's a lot of ore in this cave. This is the biggest cave I've come across so far. Let me drop that so we can all see. And so what we're going to do is we're going to pull all the platinum out of here that we can and then after that we'll grab the aluminum and the titanium and I need a little more iron too so we'll probably grab some of that but that now gets us enough to get uh, the platinum pick and then hopefully we can get the platinum knife and platinum axe as well so there's some aluminum uh, but let's look and see if there's any more platinum in here first before we grab the other stuff because we have a little bit of a hike back. What's this? Okay, that's titanium. Um, so this kind of goes around in a little bit of a circle thing here. Uh, so let's go... Pretty sure both of those are copper. Yeah. Um, that's probably copper too. Yep. And... They, they, they all look kind of similar, so it's... I mean, to, to me they do anyway, so I haven't gotten to the point yet where I'm, I can recognize what's what. I know that that's, you know, that's definitely iron, that's definitely aluminum, so I can recognize those. But the titaniums and the platinums kind of look similar. It looks like that's probably some gold up there. Let's see, can we jump up here? Okay, I don't see anything back behind here. That's... Copper too, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to probably build some kind of a structure to get up to that gold. That's iron. That's copper. And some more uh, coal. And I think that's it. Okay, well, let's grab the aluminum and the titanium. And then we'll grab, uh, what if we have some space left, we'll grab some iron. Uh, because like I said, I, need, I actually need some more iron. And then I'm not going to grab the copper, of course. And if we still have space after that, which we won't, I'd probably grab the coal. All right, so I'm going to do this. I'll meet you guys back at the base, and we'll make a platinum pickaxe. Oh, I'm so excited. It's going to be awesome. All right, guys. I... <laughs> Damn it, Jim. I, I, I did my infamous little trick where I thought I was recording then I wasn't kind of thing. So, shit. I made the platinum pick. Sorry I didn't do that on camera. But you guys saw me get the rest of the platinum th that I needed, so you knew I was going to be able to do that. But, oh man, that sucks. So anyway, yeah, we made the platinum pick. And then uh, uh, we had a stupid storm going on right now. But I started laying down these foundations here and putting some pillars in the water down there and then I ran out of material so um, I gotta go you know mine up a whole crap ton of stone basically I've got lots of wood here but I have to get a lot of stone and let's see what else oh and I rearranged the the house here uh, so as you can see I, I put in an upper floor I don't have the ladder um, learned so we have to use the ramp and I put the uh, machining bench and the cement mixer and my bedroll up up here for now um, and you know just made more room I stuck this straight in the corner because I might make another one and stick it right next to it uh, so we can get double our production going but I'm not worried about that right now and then this is just working on um, smelting all, all of the ores that we brought back from that camp so right now it's working on aluminum and I think that gets you, gets you caught up so uh, sorry about that. I thought I was recording and I wasn't, but <laughs> that's the way it goes. Uh, so anyway, I will. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna cut the camera here. Wait for this stupid storm to get over, and then I'm gonna go mine a whole mess of stone, uh, so that we can really get started uh, with our main build in earnest. Because, you know, this little house has been great for us, but, you know, as we continue to 
advance and learn more stations, uh, we're going to need more room. And uh, so that's the plan. All right. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye-bye. All right, guys. I'm back. And as you can see, I'm in a new cave. I did uh, farm up a whole bunch of <coughs> stone for our build. But I need some more wood. And I got to thinking, well, I'd really like to have that Platinum Max to do the wood too. So... I'm out looking for it again. So anyway, I found a cave uh, not too far away from our base, actually, right in this little section here that's marked on the map. And I found at least one platinum in here. I just killed off the worms. And um, so we're going to grab that. That, I believe, is titanium. That's platinum right there. I think, I think I'm starting to be able to recognize it. Yes, it is. Okay. So we need to get enough of this stuff to make an axe. And I did uh, hit the next level while I mined all the stone, too. Um, so we should be able to take the Platinum Axe. So let's get um, this ore here. And I'll show you the other spot that I saw. One, I haven't completely explored the whole cave. We got more aluminum and stuff in here, too. So I'll probably grab that after I get <clears throat> all the Platinum that I need. This cave has, has a lot deeper water in it, too, by the way, which is interesting. Um, made fighting off the worms a little more challenging. So that's a titanium. Uh, I'm starting to be able to recognize now. That's iron. That's aluminum. That's gold. This, I think, is platinum here. Yes, it is. Okay, cool. So this is actually a third node because this isn't the only one that I found. There's another one kind of off to our left here. Uh, let's grab this little piece here and I didn't hear the noise it makes when you you know when you completely mine it out but I don't see any more platinum here huh okay uh, the other piece I found tucked up in here Getting up here's a pain in the butt though man <clears throat> And we got pneumonia. Yeah, yes. I don't know why I can't get up there. Doesn't seem to be like it should be that hard. All right, let's 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 do this. Let's go. I did bring a couple ramps with me. So if we put this here. Um, well. <laughs> we got to be able to get up on the ramp, too. Um, right there, maybe. Seems to be like a... There we go. Okay, finally. Goodness. What a pain in the butt. Um, okay, let's um, put that there too. Well, that isn't going to work too well, is it? Well, let's let's mine up the first part of it anyway. Which is just about, I think, that much. Uh, I know we can hit this part too. Okay, and then we're going to have to pick this back up. And see if we can... I don't want to fall... Actually, you know what, though? If we fell down there, we can just pick the other ramp up to get out. So, yeah, not too worried about that, actually. Uh, we might have to to get in here, though. Yeah, there we go. I'm making this harder than I need to. Okay, that was the the completion. Now, how much ore do we have? We have 80. We needed a total of 60, plus I have a few ingots back at the base. So if we could actually get 120, we could make the knife, too. Um, but I don't think, well, I, I shouldn't say that. I haven't explored the whole cave. Let's explore the whole cave. There might be more platinum in here. That's titanium. That's iron. That's aluminum. That's iron. That's copper. Got coal there. That's gold. More copper. Uh, more iron. Okay. Let's look along this side. That's going to be titanium. That's copper, gold. There's a goodly amount of ore in here, that's for sure. 
Oh, that's that's platinum right there. Okay. Can we do this and uh, we couldn't quite jump. There we go. Okay. Yeah, this is platinum too. Nice. Alright. This is the most platinum I found in a single cave so far. Okay, hold on. What are we hitting? Right here. And right here. There we go. We got all of it. So how much do we have now? We have a hundred, so we would need twenty more. Uh, no, that's copper. Oh. No, I think that's... Oh. Where the hell is that coming from? Oh, he's way over there. Alright, let's go take him out. Oh, uh, this... he Yeah, he was just a little higher up. Is that platinum there? No, it's copper. Copper and the platinum look really similar to one another. Alright, let's go back over this way. Pretty sure this is copper too. It's actually a copper and an iron together. This is, I'm pretty sure it's copper. Yep. And I'm pretty sure this is copper. Yes, it is. Okay, so... Man, how high up does this cave go? I can't... I can... Yeah, I can see barely see the stalactites at the top there. Alright, we only need 20 more, and then we can make the knife and the axe. We already checked this for copper, right? Let's look again. Yeah, just want to make sure, because... Again, they look really similar. Is there anything up this way? Wow, that's deep. I don't see anything more up that direction. Okay, well, um, here, let's re-eat here. Well, we got 100, so we definitely can do the axe, which is what I really wanted to do. That's iron there, too. What's that? That's titanium, I think. All right, well, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to get the rest of... I'm going to get all the aluminum, and then if I have space left over, I'll grab titanium. I don't think we need iron right now. And then I'll meet you guys back at the base, and we'll be able to make uh, a platinum axe at least, and then we'll see where things are from there. Okay, so I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, we're back at the base. Uh, I lucked out and found one more platinum node up <clears throat> a little bit higher. So we have a total of 138 platinum ingots, which is just amazing. Uh, it's going to take a while for these uh, to smelt, though. It takes, it takes them quite some time, um, like a minute and a half or so per. Um, so while that's going on, I wanted to... Uh, we're going to cook a couple things, so let's get a drink here. And we're going to put these guys in here and make some creamed corn. And we also made up a bunch more fruit salad, so we're doing good with that. Okay, let's put these back in our inventory. Uh, then we also have uh, brought back some aluminum, <clears throat> some titanium, and so forth. But I don't want to put that in yet because I think the forge will prioritize those over the platinum. It seems to like to do the cheaper stuff first, I guess. So, well, let's put the aluminum in here and 
the titanium. I guess I don't have a spot for that in there. We're going to have to come up with a better storage solution when we get the main base built. Okay, cool. So let's take a look at our points here. Um, now that we have enough platinum, uh, well, let's do talents first. So we've been focusing on combat, and uh, we might as well get that arrow damage. So we've basically had a 20% damage with these two talents uh, to our bow damage. And then, you know, now that we've done that, we'll have to figure out what we're going to do next uh, with these. Okay, so tech tree. We want to go to tier 3. We want to learn the Platinum Axe and the Platinum Knife. That leaves us one point left, and that point's going to go back to Tier 2 so we can finish out our uh, leather set. There we go. Okay, let's grab some uh, fiber and leather. And we'll go upstairs and make our leather boots. I did set up the textile station here. Uh, no, wait. Hold on a sec. What? Uh, it's hands I needed, right? Or arms, rather. Yeah. Okay. So we'll make the leather arms. Awesome. There we go. So now we are fully armored in uh, our leather set, which is great. Very cool. Um, I might actually just keep this stuff in here for now. Uh, we do have... Uh, oh, never mind. I thought I had some... Wait, what? I thought I had some platinum ingots up here in that bench. Did I take them back down here? Oh, I did. Okay, so we already have four platinum ingots made up. So now we're just waiting on these. Uh, we're going to need 12 for the axe and 12 for the kniffy. Okay, cool. <clears throat> so that's done. Uh, let's go ahead and sleep. Okay. Oops. Um, I have to to crouch <laughs> to get out of there because my head gets stuck in the ceiling there. All right, so it is morning, which is great. Uh, let's have some food here. All right, so um, we're just pretty much waiting now uh, for these ingots, but I think we can probably get started. Uh, with some more building. It's a little bit dark. But, um, yeah, I made some more pieces up. So let's go grab more foundations. I think I made like 20 more of each piece or something like that. Um, yeah, so we have 20 foundations. Can we carry that many with us? Oh, yeah, we can. You'd think those would be a lot heavier, huh? Well, let's grab the 20 posts. And we'll grab... The 20 stone floors. Okay, now we're a tad bit on the heavy side. But that's okay. We're going to lay some foundations down right away. I'll bring this back out until it gets a little bit lighter. So we can all see. All right. Now, <clears throat> what I want to do here is... I want... I think I want to go one more out on the foundations this way, I think. Hmm. Here, let's put a couple more of these in right now, just so we're not encumbered. Wow. You'd really think these th things would be heavier than they are. Alright, let's get that back out. So this is going to be, probably be like a, just a little back porch. So I think our back wall is going to be actually along this seam here. Um, <clears throat> but I'm thinking I want to go a little bit wider. Uh, maybe even on both sides. So let's, um, let's go ahead and put that there and that there. And we're going to probably put a couple foundations underneath there, too. Just uh, My understanding is we want to make sure that it's fully touching the ground for proper support later on. 
Okay. We are still encumbered. My goodness. Unbelievable. Okay, let's do this. Let's grab these pillars next. And we already have those down there. So let's... Uh, come on. There you go. Okay. You get on there. You get on there. And I think we're going to have to place some more down there. Okay. So we can now do these. It shows the arrow pointing to the right, but does that really matter with these particular pieces? I don't know. Okay, we'll put that in there. All right, let's go down into the water now and stick these pieces in place. Again, I'm not sure if I have to do that, but I'm just going to do it. And then we're going to need to put another pillar there and there. Oh, uh, no, that, those did not snap correctly. Whoops. All right, we want them to snap... Is that right? Yeah. That is right. Okay. It's like that. And then let's go to this side and do the same thing. The building in this game is just amazing. You know, with the snapping and how it figures out where it needs to go. I am very impressed, I have to say. Very impressed indeed. Let's put that one there, that one there, and then we should put that one there. Okay, let's get the surface here. All right, now I guess the question I have now is um, one, two, three, four. Do I need all of those pillars. Could I, like, take every other one out, for example? Or not? Um, also, I think I'm gonna want... That's weird. It's like the foundations are hollow or something. I think I'm gonna want at least two more foundations, maybe even three more to finish out this little corner here. And maybe even one here too. So four, yeah, so let's make four more foundations to get that done. There we go. We'll get that taken care of. How are we doing on our ingots? We have 11, so just about have the 12th one. <coughs> and then we can make the axe. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Boom, baby. Okay, what else do we need with the axe? Um, I think we need leather and wood, or leather and sticks. So let's grab a leather out of here. I don't remember if it was wood or sticks. Let's just go look. It's wood. Okay, so we need two pieces of wood. Let's just grab this wood out of here. Yeah, see, I'm, now wood's the thing I gotta get, and that's why I wanted to have this platinum axe to do it with. There we go. Oh, look at that, you guys. Hot damn. Okay. There she is. Platinum Max. Love it. Okay, and we'll make the platinum knife, too, uh, when the, we have 12 more ingots ready to go. Ah, beautiful.
Okay, so let's grab the f other four foundations here. And we'll go stick those in on this corner. So we want one there. One there. Uh, one there. And... I guess we'll put that one in there. So there's there's a little gap here, but um, I mean it, it's I think it's touching the ground plenty plenty good enough to not have to worry about it. All right. Now the next thing I want to do is let's get back up there, and I want to count and see how many foundations that is. Because we're probably going to want an odd number. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, perfect. That's what we want is seven. Very cool. All right, now, uh, I think from here we're going to build a bridge to the land. Um, uh, or... I might want to actually build this out even further. So if we were to I have to I have to think about I got to think about a couple things. So this is going to be the wall here. Uh, let's grab uh, Oh, I guess I didn't grab the walls. Okay. Let's go grab some walls, just so I can kind of use them to keep my bearings here. Okay, now we're over encumbered a little bit. That's all right. We'll make do. Okay, so... Let's put a wall here. And what I want to decide now is if we're going to keep this as a walkway or if we want to put ceiling pieces down as a walkway. So let's just look at this for a second. So this is a five wide building. And we could uh, oh this is this is kind of neat. You can make like a wide window or a wide door, a double door. Well that's neat. How do you uh, how do you make a double door? Is there like an actual thing for that? Let's go to tier three. Or no, actually tier two. We have reinforced doors. Stone half pieces. Can we make a, a like a double version of this? You know, actually we need to make this for the other building too now that I think about it. Let's go make one and see what it looks like. Um, but actually before we do that, so what I was thinking is this would be the, the interior size of, of the ground floor anyway. And then we would take and put... another layer of these guys out kind of as a walkway like make a little porch we could even here let's press r well that's the only option it gives us huh no like rounded shapes maybe we have to learn those i might even want this to go out like two so we have kind of like a big porch area 
either that or we pull this in one and make the ground floor a little little narrower because we're I'm gonna do an upper floor too. Actually, yeah, I kind of like that idea. Now that I think about it, because I have plans. So let's make the corner here and here instead. So that does make the bottom floor a little narrower, but like I said, um, we're going to have an, a top floor or a second floor. And the second floor is going to be like a hangover kind of idea. So it'll be, it'll be larger. I think that's what we're going with. I, I am definitely making this up as I go along. <laughs> that wasn't obvious, right? Uh, okay, let's go back in here. I want to make that door. Uh, we probably do that in here, right? Let's see. Uh, no, where do we make this door at? Oh, the crafting bench. Okay, so we make it in here. Uh, so we're going to need nails and iron ingots. So let's grab uh, a stack of iron ingots. And we should have uh, some nails in here. And then we're also going to need uh, some rope. Uh, I don't think I have any extra rope. We're going to have to make some. How many can we make? Nine? Yeah, let's make nine. I put my platinum pickaxe in there. Why would I do such a thing? Oh, I know why. I probably shifted, dragged something from here to here, and it popped it in. Okay. We actually want to make two of these. One to use on this building. And then the other ones for the other building. Okay, so let's grab this. And we're going to... Why can't I remove my door? I'm pressing Y and it won't remove it. Oh, hold to pick up. Oh. I guess it considers a Dora something different. Okay, so that's the reinforced door. Okay. So, um, let's grab the other reinforced door. Now, do we have a double version of this? We don't, so that means we probably just have to put two down and then flip them around. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. Okay, are our other platinum ingots done? Where you need one more, just about there. One more. Um, why don't we take one from here? Uh, whoops, I keep hitting the wrong thing. Okay, and then uh, I'm sure we're going to need wood and leather for the knife. Which we already have. All right, look at that, you guys. Platinum knife. We'll probably maybe should start putting some uh, knowledge points or whatever those other points are into this. Um, so let's compare. This is the iron knife we've been using. That does 54 to 60 melee. This does 66 to 70 melee. Okay, so potentially like 20, 20 more. Uh, we don't really use the knife projectile and the same yield from skinning. So really all it does is give us more damage uh, and has more durability. This is 80,000 versus 40,000. So it's got twice the durability. Nice, man. I love it. Okay, we are in the Platinum Age, baby. Yes, indeed we are. Okay, let's put the iron knife in here. Um, and the iron axe can go in here. We'll keep those as backups. And now we got a Platinum Axe, a Platinum Pick, and a Platinum Kniffy. 
Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, so let's let this finish smelting uh, the rest of the platinum, and we'll need those ingots for repairing. And then uh, I'll, I'll throw the other stuff, the aluminum, the titanium, and so forth in here and get that smelted up. I don't even know what you, we need titanium for, but I'm sure we need it for something. Okay, well, we've got a crappy windstorm going on. And I think, guys, what I'm going to do is i gotta, uh, I got to cut a bunch of wood. Well, we do have the wood stockpiles, but and either way, we need more wood. So I think I'm, we're going we're gonna to go ahead and wrap up this episode here, and then I'm going to work on getting more resources together. And then in the next episode, we will continue uh, the build. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. How do I get him to hold still so I can see the front of him? It's not control. Is it alt? It's alt. Oh, there we go. Look at me my bad self with my platinum knife. See ya.